looking at an Energy Star house with Al Rosetto, our serial enabler, and the two homeowners, Dave and Kathy Glasser. So you guys acted as the general contractors. Yeah, we really knew nothing about building at all. We started looking, I started looking on the internet about what the different options were, and I, I came upon this idea of, of SIPs, uh, structurally insulated panels, and I, I just sent out an email team if there was anybody in this area that had built any houses, and um, I got directed from someone else to Alan. And he's a master educator as well as a builder, and, and so he convinced us that uh, we could do this. And so what's your construction experience? By day, are you a builder, or are you an architect? or? By day, I am a jazz musician. A jazz musician, so that's Saxophone not player. exactly like... Who never used a power tool in his life. Well, great, let's have a look around. Okay. What we did was we used simple American technology that is mature that allowed them to put in the footings, to put in the foundation, to put in the radiant heat, to actually be hands-on putting up the structural insulated panels, and this is the result. So it looks like a timber frame structure. Is this structural or is it just aesthetic? Well, we needed a structural ridge for the panels. We could have used engineered lumber and wrapped it in sheetrock, but we wanted to give the place a little bit of pizzazz because it's not a big house, so we wanted to have some very nice details. And you know, it's not a complete timber frame, it's just a vertical spine okay. here and up at the ridge, which supports the panels, which is what we needed. She used SIP panels, which Correct. are pretty darn plug and play. After the hole was dug, um, it took us three days of work basically to put in the former drain and the ICFs and then put um, all the sub slab plumbing and conduits and, and backfill it to have it ready to pour the slab. So I mean that's where you save I think, yeah. you know, because if you built it in a traditional stick built way, you'd have, it would take a lot longer it a bit longer. and it it's a lot more hammering, it's a lot yeah. more so, and, and a lot more technical. The building is a, is a simple rectangle. So, you know, we, we, we avoided any nooks and crannies and different things because, um, and, and we also figured out uh, what the size of the building could be within our budget. And we had very limited space, so the heating system yeah. is underneath the stairs. You have your water tank. This is a superstore um, insulated um, hot water tank and the house is heated with hot water through radiant tubing in the slab. We have this manifold here so Alan and I ran the, the PEX tubing. That was another aspect of the build that, that we did ourselves. And of course a manifold system does save water uh, because you don't spend as much time running water to wait for hot water. It comes a lot faster. But its real claim to fame is it's simple. So this is our little attic. Here you get a look at what we did in between the panels. That's why I like this up here because what's very important is when you put the panels together, if you don't completely seal the envelope there, you're going to have air going right out your building. So what you do is you put two pieces of wood on each uh -huh. side and then you, you nail them together and then you drill holes through those 1x4s and you put spray foam in there to completely seal the joints. And that's what really gets the, the Energy Star rating up off the charts. Alan noticed in the winter when he came by that there was an icicle on the side of the house on the outside, which meant that uh -huh. warm, moist air was going out to the building. So I go up here with my little light, and there it is in big letters, foam. That was from the yeah. summertime when we built the house. Oh, and you he missed knew, it. He knew there was a spot up there, but I finally got it, and I just went away. So. <laughs> Good job. You go through it, you know. Was it worth it in the long run? It's a lot of hard work if you participate in it yourself, just physical mm -hmm. labor. But if you have the proper guidance of what to do and how to do it, it's not difficult, and it was a lot of fun. I mean, it was. I really enjoyed being involved in it here. Can you play us a song to take sure. this thing out? Um.